<laughs> we learn, we learn, we learn. Nobody wanted to feel that 0 5 again. And we learned how to win. We played some good teams during that like seven game stretch or something. We just learned what it takes to win. And then we got um, relearned earlier in the year when we went that, that two game skid. Uh, we weren't working as well as we should have. Uh, like I always say, we ain't got no Hollywood guy to get back to work and learn how to uh, compete with each other and put, get a W on the on the board. What was the message after that Pittsburgh touchdown? Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, we gave him a couple. I mean, I had a pass interference on that one. Uh, a couple, like, missed tackles and stuff. Just get back to playing hard. Um, we were really on them the whole game, so it wasn't nothing to panic about. They had to go down and score again, like make them do it again. But just keep playing the way we was playing. They ain't done nothing special for real yet. So no no need to panic. Just do what we do. Like just trust in ourselves, believe in ourselves. That's all it's going to take today. I know you guys were quiet about it in the locker room this week. But, uh, clearly, I'm going to be quiet about it now. Clearly the Jay Villains took, uh, took some insult to George Pickens. Everybody. That's a full defense stuff. Um, and it's a full team thing. You know, we put a lot of work in week in, week out. Uh, you know, credit to him, hell of a player. Uh, you know, just just believe in ourselves and put that put that on tape. What I forgot what he said, hoping, right? I mean, I don't know how many. I looked up at one point, it was like 120 in the air, maybe 20 some on the ground. You know, but for hope defense, I guess we hope pretty well today. But good player, um, prayed a lot today. God had us. What do you think has you know the confidence for this team to you know be quiet during the week when someone says something like that? But now, you, but now you guys are at a confidence point where you're not afraid to say. I I no, nah, I, I got credit to everybody. He's a hell of a player. Uh, Pittsburgh, hell of a team. Um, but I, I told the boys, like, somebody comes at one of us, you know, comes at all of us, that's the full team thing. So just opportunity to prove it to ourselves. Um, obviously, if we came out and, and laid an egg, it's going to be right, right? So come out here and play how we're supposed to play and keep putting our best foot forward. What does Dewey mean to this, yeah. this team? Dewey, just like he, he, our persona, like, you know, look at him. We talk about yeah, ethos. Oh yeah, good word, good word. Ethos. That's our ethos right there, bro. Like, put him in, plug him in, make plays. That's what we do. Regardless of what happens, regardless of what position he's gonna put in, he's out there to ball. So everybody kind of takes that persona, that ethos, and we just keep balling. What part of the defensive game were you most proud of? Yours, this whole team. What were you most proud of today? The points that they scored. We got some turnovers. We won. I like winning. That's about it. I mean, I'll go see, see what happened. I think we played pretty physical. I don't know if they really ran it on us that much. Kind of call out a lot of their plays before they happen. Um, we might see them again later. That's a good team. So hats off to them. Be, re be prepared if we see them later. How much was focus part of the, the focus? How much focus was the focus this week because you knew you were coming off a 10-day layoff and then you have the bye next week? It's focus because it's the next game. And when you win, like, people might start chilling a little bit. And I hate that feeling. Like, I really hate it when I feel like we're being a little bit too relaxed. We know what it takes to win in the locker room, and we got to stay on it because we've seen it earlier in the year. We won a little first game, and then we went through a two-game skid. Like, once you take your foot off the pedal, it's not good for anybody. So be able to – the leaders in the locker room and the, even the young guys are on it. We're coming to work every day, and after the bye week, you're going to get back to it.